Hello and welcome to Indian Drives. In this video, we briefly explain you the mechanism of the Electronic Stability Program, which is also known as the ESP. But before we do any of that, do not forget to subscribe to our channel so you do not miss out on such interesting automotive content. So without any further delay, let's begin with the video. Development of the Electronic Stability Program began in the late 1980s when Toyota introduced the anti-skid control for the flagship sedan, the Crown. Other manufacturers followed Toyota and started developing their own variations of the safety system. Since then, ESP has evolved and gotten better with newer age technology. The Electronic Stability Program is a technology that detects any loss in grip and automatically applies brakes to the required wheels to improve the vehicle's stability. The ESP works with the help of wheel speed sensors and steering angle. The modules continuously keep all the parameters in check and as soon as any loss of traction is detected, the ESP intervenes to bring the car back into a safe driving line. Now there's a myth about the ESP. A lot of people believe that the ESP increases a vehicle's cornering performance. Whereas the reality is that the ESP just reduces the probability of a vehicle losing its traction. The easiest way to understand the working of ESP would be a sudden swerve on the highway. Imagine if you're driving your vehicle on a highway at a speed of 80 km an hour and due to the oncoming traffic, if you were to swerve the steering wheel suddenly, the vehicle without an ESP system would definitely spin and lose traction. In some case, the vehicle could possibly roll over. Whereas with the ESP system in place, braking is automatically applied to wheels individually such as the outer front wheel to counter oversteer or the inner rear wheel to counter understeer. Some ESP systems also reduce the engine power until control is regained by the driver. If you like our content, do like this video, share this with your like-minded friends and do not forget to subscribe to our channel for such interesting automotive content.